destroyed in 786 BC by the uh, by the uh, Babylonian. They found that they also they found other uh, several houses that destroyed by the Babylonian. And uh, it's very very interesting because when we're talking about when we're talking about the, this area, okay, we talk about Jerusalem, we're talking about the city of David. How we can understand the Bible by the finding in the city of David? Of course, we found the Bula with the name, but the topography of Jerusalem, the topography of, of building houses here, it's you're building houses on the slope, and you know. Wherever you're building a house on the slope, you have a terrace wall and house. A terrace wall and house. You know, when you're on the top, you can see what's happening down below. Wherever you go in the world, when you're building houses on the slope of the hill, when you're on the top, you can see the roof of the other houses below, uh, down below. Uh, it's mean, this, is, this is the way. And why I'm saying that? I'm saying that because there's a story in the Bible. Very interesting story. Uh, David standing in, in his, uh, some say in the balcony, some say in the house, but the palace was on the top, there somewhere, okay? And where Bathsheba, she was on the roof. And the question was, he can see her? So if you are living in New York, everything is flat, in Manhattan, everything is flat, and the house is the same, plus the same level, you cannot see her. But if you're living in, uh, for example, in the hill area, in Los Angeles, on the hills there, you know, okay, you can see her. Okay, we are in Jerusalem. So if you're in Jerusalem, you can see her. This is the topography. So when the Bible talking about David seeing Bathsheba, you can see Bathsheba because it's right. This is the way of building houses. Even she was on the roof. Sometimes you say, oh, she was on the roof. Maybe she was there. I cannot see her because she was there. No, you can see her because the building houses here different. Okay? And the building houses with the terrace wall, you can see, for example, you can see here one building, this is a four house building, and the burn house in the second terrace down below. And then they have another terrace, then another terrace, and the house is building on the terrace all the way to the area of the Gihon Spring, to the area of the spring. Well, you can see a modern example of this. Look at the uh, Sylvan neighborhood behind us. You see how it's tiered? It's see on a hill. You see our roof on the uh, top of the other? Okay. Uh -huh. This is very interesting. So what Bathsheba did? She was on the roof and she making a bat. And I know, I know, I know, sometimes she's thinking, oh, she did a full bat. She was a naked. David fell in love with her because she was naked. And just I want to tell you between us, I know this is sometimes you think about that way. I write or not? Oh, thank you. But, well, but what I want to tell you, you know, you can fall in love with a lady without seeing her naked. <laughs> and this is the reality. Not Thankfully. Seeing, yeah, no, no. This is the reality. Not seeing the lady naked and then you fall in love with her. you see seen her and you talk with her, and you fall in love, not because she is naked, because she is a real woman, that you have a connection with her, you feeling everything. So, not because that reason. And why to put that on Bathsheba? In our life, we're out to our, 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 our life. Which way our life? Moving, you know? I met some lady, I'm talking, I, I have a connection, I have feeling, I have that, I'm... Before I'm seeing her naked, <laughs> I'm dating with her. Why, but Jeba is seeing her naked and naked and fell in love with her. Frank, what's going on? Uh, I don't know. Ellie. Hallelujah. Yeah, hallelujah. Yeah. What? She's the mother of King Solomon. <laughs> so, which bat she did? Okay. Some say she, she, she did the full bat. The Bible didn't give us information about which bat she did. But from my point of view, I think she did the foot bat. <laughs> Why, you see, oh come on, why oh come on? That can't be right. <laughs> why not? I'm asking question, why not? David had a foot fetish, how do you know? <laughs> <laughs> Could have been it. No, uh, why, why you think that she did the full bed and not the foot bed? Where it's written in the Bible? So she was like fully clothed, just washed her feet. And then... Yes, why not? So like... Yeah, what the problem? What the problem? <laughs> that, that made him want to have, have sex 
No. <laughs> Isn't that what no happened, one said. Like, no right look, look. In that moment, no one says she have a she have a sex relationship between themselves. It okay? was pretty shortly her. after. Yeah. It was something some somewhere after, but she seen her. She seen her blonde hair jumping <laughs> and blue eyes. <laughs> and <not. laughs> What's going on? Why not? Why, why, why not? What's 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 happened between what's happened then? It was wrong, and we know all this. Stuff. We already talk about that. So, but I, what I, I'm just taking, I'm just taking. What is the reality? And now we can understand the reality. Okay, we good okay. with that? Yeah. Okay, let's move because they found also foot bat in the excavation. Okay. <laughs> okay, so. Basking his glory for a second. Uh, yeah. The great Ali Shukran, ladies and gentlemen. Yes. Do you know who this is? Yeah. Yes. How long have you been? Elijah from the Galilee. Yeah. yeah. Four days. Huh? Four days? Uh -huh. I'm so sorry for you. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, wait, Shane. This is Eli Shukran. He's the archaeologist of the city of David. <laughs> and that's it. Ma? Okay. <laughs> He's been to my wedding like that. That's <laughs> my proudest moment. Ilan, <laughs> 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 <laughs>